Witchy Wendy's Magical Mishap Good Bedtime Stories for Kids Today we have a book named Witchy Wendy's Magical Mishap Good Bedtime Stories for Kids I think they're so pretty. I hope you guys really enjoy it. I love it. Please give this video a like if you enjoy it and don't forget to subscribe for more stories. Thank you, reading. So, here we go. In a quaint little cottage nestled deep in the enchanted forest lived a young witch named Wendy. Wendy was not your typical witch. She didn't have a crooked nose or a black pointy hat. Instead, she had a friendly smile and a heart full of good intentions. Wendy's dream was to use her magic to make the world a better place. One sunny morning, Wendy decided to try a new spell she had learned from her magical books. It was a spell to create a beautiful bouquet of flowers that would never wither. She thought, what a wonderful gift this would be for the creatures of the forest. With a flick of her wand and a sprinkle of stardust, Wendy cast the spell. However, something unexpected happened. Instead of a bouquet of flowers, a shower of colorful confetti burst from her wand and filled the room. Wendy blinked in surprise, and her cat whiskers meowed with confusion. Undeterred, Wendy decided to try the spell again. She concentrated harder this time, focused on the image of the beautiful flowers in her mind. She waved her wand with determination and chanted the incantation. But once more, a shower of confetti rained down upon her. Wendy couldn't help but laugh at the magical mishap. She gathered the confetti into her hands and tossed it into the air. To her surprise, it transformed into a swarm of butterflies, each more dazzling than the last. The room was filled with fluttering wings and colors. Whiskers leaped into the air, playfully batting at the butterfly. Wendy joined in, twirling among the enchanting creatures. She couldn't deny that her spell, although not what she had intended, had brought unexpected joy. Feeling adventurous, Wendy decided to experiment with more spells. She turned an ordinary broom into a balloon, causing it to float around the room. She turned a cup of tea into a bubbling fountain of lemonade. She even turned her mirror into a portal that led to a whimsical meadow filled with talking animals. Every spell Wendy cast resulted in something entirely different from her intention. She had turned her cozy cottage into a place of magical mayhem. But instead of feeling frustrated, Wendy found herself giggling with delight. Each mishap brought a new surprise, and she couldn't wait to see what would happen next. News of Wendy's magical misadventures spread throughout the enchanted forest. Creatures from all corners of the woods came to visit her, hoping to witness the hilarious surprises her spells would bring. Wendy's cottage became a gathering place for laughter and wonder. One sunny afternoon... As Wendy and her friends were enjoying a tea party with teacups that transformed into miniature merry-go-rounds, a group of forest animals approached her. They had a special request. They explained that the enchanted forest was in need of a good laugh, and they believed Wendy's magical mishaps could provide just that. With a mischievous smile, Wendy agreed to help. She cast her most unpredictable spells, turning trees into giant lollipops, raindrops into musical notes, and acorns into bouncing rubber balls. The forest was filled with laughter, and even the most serious creatures couldn't help but chuckle. As the sun began to set, Wendy felt a sense of fulfillment. She realized that her magical mishaps, although not what she had initially aimed for, had brought joy and laughter to the enchanted forest. Her heart swelled with happiness, knowing that she had made a difference. That night, 
Wendy sat on her porch, gazing at the starry sky. Whiskers curled up in her lap and she whispered, Magic doesn't always go as planned, but sometimes it leads us to exactly where we're meant to be. And so, in her little cottage in the heart of the enchanted forest, Witchy Wendy continued to cast her whimsical spells, bringing laughter, surprises, and a touch of magic to the lives of all who crossed her path. The End Good job, friends. Thank you so much for reading with me. Bye, I'll see you next time.